Hi everyone, my name is Aditya. My name is Hasni. My name is Ishi. And we together are going to broadcast a video based on rocket. Okay, Hasni, what's a rocket? A rocket is a missile, spacecraft, aircraft, or just a vehicle that is generally used to explore space and planets. It is also used for communication and defense purposes. Now, little Ishi, the mastermind, will take over and notify the design of a rocket. There are generally three parts of a rocket. First is payload system, second is Caribbean system, third is propulsion system. I have made an origami rocket. Wow, the rocket is very cute. It has the payload system, very informative. Wow. The flames. Yeah, the engines. Wow, so cute. I bet you have taken a lot of time and effort to make it. Bravo. Thank you. Thank you. Now, Kasi, Akka and Madik Channa are going to tell about the structure of the rocket. I am going to say about the first part, the payload system. It depends on what the rocket is used for. If the rocket is used to take humans out of space, then it has a space rocket. If the rocket is used for communication and defense purposes, then it has a satellite unit. Aditya, now Aditya now will explain about the guidance system and the propulsion system. This is the guidance system. The guidance system commands the rocket where to go and where to not. It tells the rocket which direction to move and which angle to move. So when the rocket launches, then also for gathering information about the rocket, the guidance system ha has a communication device to to interact with NASA and other space stations. Now, I'm gonna say about the propulsion system. The propulsion system contains a fuel, oxidizers, the pipes, the pumps, and also the exhaust. The, the fuel, which is over here, it has the material which is used for burning. And with this fuel, the frame is generated. And the oxidizers. The oxidizers contain oxygen. As you know, there is no oxygen in the space. So, there is a separate tank for oxygen. As you know, there is there is no there can't be a combustion without oxygen. So, we even kept an oxygen tank in, inside the rocket for burning. The pipes connect the oxygen tank and the fuel together in specific point. Those point is the pumps. In these pumps, when they both meet, the fuel and oxidizers both meet together and get ignited. With this ignition, then the flame will start burning. And this combusted material goes through the pipe and comes to the exhaust. The exhaust is the final part of the rocket. Here, when the flame come out, the rocket will take off. As you know, the Newton's third law of motion, every action has an equal and opposite reaction. The rocket is pushing the force downwards and the ground due to that force is pushing the rocket upwards. With that, the rocket flies. Hope you understand the structure of rocket. If you like this video, please like and share. If, and the comment box is free right here. Bye! Bye. Have a nice day!